this video, we will do the ukulele tutorial for the song See You Again. But we will only do the chorus part. So for this song, we need to learn three easy chords. And these are C, ring finger, third fret, first string. Next chord, we have G, index finger, second fret, third string, middle finger, second fret, first string, and ring finger, third fret, second string. And our last chord is E minor, ring finger, fourth fret, third string, middle finger, third fret, second string, and index finger, second fret, first string. For this song, we will use two sets of strumming patterns. The first one will be down, 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 up. Let's try it with the C chord. Down, 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 up. Again, down, 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 up. The second strumming pattern will be down, down, up, up, down, 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 up. Sounds like this with the C chord. Down, down, up, up, down, 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 up. Again. Before we apply the strumming patterns, let's first learn the intro. For the intro, we will use one chord and it's G. First, we will position our hand like G, pero hindi natin ipipress yung middle finger. So it looks like this. Let's learn the intro. But first, let's learn the names of the strings. The top string is the G string or the fourth string. G, C or third string, E or second string, and A or first string. So this is four, three, two, and one. Gawin natin yung position na parang G, pero walang middle finger. And the intro goes like this. Three, one, two, three. Again, three, one, two, three. Then, two, one. Then do the G chord. One, release the middle finger. One, two, one. Let's do that slowly. It sounds like this. Again. One more. Two, one, 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 two, one. Two, one, 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 two, one. And again, we'll do the first part. So the full intro sounds like this. I'll do it slowly. Three, one, two, three. Two, one, 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 two, one, three, one, two, three. So that's our intro. Now let's go to chorus. For the whole chorus, we will only use two chords and these are C and G. Also, for the whole chorus, we will use the first strumming pattern, which is down, 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 up. So it goes like this. C, down, G, down, 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 up. Back to C, down, G, down, 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 up. That will be the pattern for the whole chorus. Let's do that without the lyrics. C, G. Now let's do that with the lyrics. It's been a long day without you, my friend. And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. We've come a long way from where we began. Oh, I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. When I see 
have the post chord rules, and the chord progression will be E minor, G, C, and G. And we will use the second set of the strumming pattern, which is down, down, up, up, down, 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 up. Maghahati yung dalawang chords sa isang strumming pattern. So E minor will have down, down, then G, up, up, down, 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 up. Then C, down, down, then G, up, up, down, 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 up. It will sound like this. Now let's sing the post chorus. Again, let's do the full chorus and post chorus. It's been a long day. So that's it guys! I hope may natutunan ka sa video na ito. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And always remember that every good and perfect gift comes from the Lord. God bless you! Ooh.